guys, welcome to today's video. So since the last time we talked, we harvested the onion, green onions, and we put the lettuce in their own individual pots. And as you can tell, they are growing very well. Some of the green onions that we harvest didn't grow out, but some also did, as you can see. So what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be planting some more of the lettuce seeds into the pot. Uh, this little seedling this tree? This little seedling tray. So that's what we're doing today. Also, I thought I should mention that today for breakfast, I had a sandwich with some of this, the lettuce, and it was absolutely delicious. It was lunch. So, lunch. So, it was brunch. So, <laughs> you should very much consider doing what we did in the last video because it really pays off and it really, it really does taste good. Yeah. And so, it's fun growing your own food. Yeah. So, we'll see you when we do that. I'm going to be picking some lettuce. Yep, pick enough for your sandwich. Yeah, you can pick that one. The thing about lettuce is that when you pick the leaves, they'll just grow more leaves. Oh, so I can pick up all of them? Yeah, if you wanted. But you got to leave at least some so that it can um, keep, keep itself alive because the plant uses the leaf for photosynthesis. Is this enough? Yeah, that looks pretty good for a BLT on a beagle, right? <laughs> Oops. Voila. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Okay. okay. So now what? Okay. So so now what we are going to do is put the lettuce seeds um in here. Oopsie, she spilled some. Yeah, okay, so we're just gonna yeah. uncover some of the soil here so that we can I have such cover a good idea. Oh, no, no, not that deep. Oh, I didn't do it. Okay, Maybe basically, the lettuce seed should go in about quarter inch deep, a little bit less, even. Eighth of an inch is fine too. General rule of thumb is planting the seeds twice, the, uh, twice as deep as the length of the seed. So we're just gonna scatter them around. Oh, we're just gonna. Yeah, just scatter it. As you and then can we'll tell, cover I'm it. not really a good gardener. Yeah, but she's learning and. I'm improving. Yes. So this is the green onions that we harvested last week. They've been seasoned with salt, pepper, and sesame oil, and we're gonna eat it with the sliced beef tenderloin. Mmm. <laughs> So this is how you eat the sliced beef tenderloin with the green onion. You could also wrap it in a lettuce leaf as well. Can we do that? Yeah. Mm. <laughs> do you want to try it with the lettuce leaf? Mm. Korean style? Mm. Okay. This is the Korean style of eating sliced beef tenderloin with the green onions in a lettuce wrap with some rice. How, How do you like it? How do you like <laughs> it? Was it really good? Do you like it? Mm -hmm. That's good. So both the lettuce and the green onions were harvested by Lauren and grown by myself and Lauren. <laughs> okay, so just to recap today's update, we have shown you that some of our green onions have sprouted. All our transplants survived from last week. And we planted some more lettuce seeds in this tray that we started some of the lettuce that went over into these individual pots. And uh, we also enjoyed some of our harvest. Lauren had some lettuce with the uh, sliced beef tenderloin and green onions that we also harvested last week and the uh, lettuce on her BLT bagel for lunch. And so that's all for today and hopefully we'll see you soon.